30 seconds, I only get 30 seconds. There are those cheesy face computer wimps spent days cracking my computer game on their pathetic little bottoms and I only get 30 seconds. Oh, hi, I didn't see you there. Welcome. Uh, let's go into the game before I um, forget what I was doing. Having a little connection problem here. Keeps dropping out every 30 seconds. Alright. Updating. Why is it updating? Is this a live update? It must do hot updates. All I want is the never uh, update to come out so I can finally open up that blah 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 censored censored inside the church. I'm not going to tell you what it is because that'll spoil everything. Alright. So I was going to work really hard on this church tonight but now I've got to play Fallout 76 Wastelanders and that could come any moment I might need to update it so it won't start anything too big until that update comes so um, we'll leave that there for now what I do want to do is I want to change this um, bakery because it looks too modern and it does look like a cake a little bit. If you put little candles on top there, you know. I don't know. But there's another problem with it. It's only got one wall. And I don't like one walls. Because if I was to change the colour of the wall inside. Oh no. See? This is why we always have two walls. So I keep saying. Double it up. That way the inside is separate from the outside. Same goes for the roof and the floor. With the floor, well the floor is the floor. But don't forget that you've probably got a roof under that floor. And you might want to put some lights. And you don't want those lights shining through. You especially don't want any ambient light shining through if you just put carpet over it. Which I've done in the past. Alright, so God, I even did it here too. It's the milk bar. <coughs> uh nothing today, thank you. Um that's gotta go too. Please hear me. Please please don't. No. Ah! Just walking away right now. Okay. Let's get rid of the fa the facade facade. Um. Well, we don't want to destroy these, so... Get behind it. And they should just fall out. And we can reuse those.
Alright. What have we got here? Three and three. Have a look at it. I'll take a few snapshots. Okay. On second thought, let's just get rid of it. Get rid of the post office. So to do that, we're going to need a phone. Where's my phone? Phone, where are you? Stop hiding. Need a notepad. Now, unlike last time, we won't screw up the coordinates. Yeah, look, look at that. It's only one wall. What was I thinking? I mean, I knew to do it in two layers. I've been doing two layers before. Alright, so the first coordinate we're going to need is, of course, well, go back here. We'll need this coordinate right here, which is. Uh, 62, got a little character in the keypad, what is that, it's a messenger. Okay, we want 62 at the height of uh, 70, and the first coordinate is 100, no, 116. And then we need a high coordinate, now I know the highest coordinate that we have here is 80. because of those chimneys and this is the most forward coordinate that we have so it'll be 30 80 and one where's my notepad gone 154 not 254 because if we go 254 it won't be like last time where we just copied this kitchen and narrowly missed that outside wall there it'll be right here and we could end up deleting this whole chunk out of this building all the way up to here we don't want to do that Alright, so here we go. Say goodbye to that building because it's about to be deleted. Whoops. First of all, we need some fill. Hello, fill. And we need 62. Also, need my phone to not blank out. 70, which is the lowest, which is ground level and 116 then we also need our secondary coordinates which is directly diagonal and at the highest point so that'll be 30 at the height of 80 and 154 just double check that I'm gonna hold the screen up and look 62, 70, 116, 30, 80, and 154. And then we'll put air. Air is nothing. So there it goes. What happened? You're going to have to find some other place to live, mate. Okay, now because I do like to recycle a bit, 
I might keep the foundations in certain places. Okay. So first of all we need our main foundation. Let's put a chest here somewhere. Love a good chest. Where are you? Nope. Come on, give me the chest. Where is it? We'll just, uh... I want to keep it out of the way. Let's keep it over here. Make two. Let's get rid of all this crap. Wait. Other way around. Where is that? Seriously, where did that come from? That must have been the post. Alright, that'll do. Alright, we need... Need some cobblestone foundation. This will be our cornerstone. Of course, we have to double it up. Now, I kind of like the idea of maybe having a row of shops. Something to consider that in the future, uh, the Sunnyside Station will be censored, censored, um, necessitating the need for a new station, which will be here. It's a sewer line. So here is the actual um, subway line. A new station will go here, and of course, these row of shops will probably demolish. So we're going to make them really something that won't be missed. But we've also got to take into consideration the size of the station. So. Let's find something nice and symmetrical that we can copy. Can't use that because... Have a look at this... This one here. I do like this shape. One, two, three. Did I double these up? I did not. Oh, because um, these are old school buildings. That's right. Heritage buildings um, don't follow the hillside code, which is a building code that I established. You know, so the city has to be at the height of 71. There has to be a certain height inside oh, a certain depth for the uh, subway station so it doesn't interfere with anything above ground um, the placement of subway lines they, they've got to be straight I can't 
have them going under if it's going to, you know, interrupt the basement of a building. So I try and put the, the subway line as close to the road as possible, because the roads don't change. Well, only in appearance, but they don't change location, so... It's good to have the subway station run under here. And the thing is, do I have it go long ways? Forget that this building exists, that's going. It's over there now. Have it going like this? Or do I have it going like this? Or do I have it huge? Like a major... You know, not just a subway station, but a, a transit centre of sorts. Transit centre means that I've got to build something big. <sighs> Decisions. See this line here? I think that's the middle. Let's get some placeholder out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Shut up, cow. 21, 22, One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, you make me angry. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, that actually makes me a bit mad, that. Although fences can be too wide. Now I've forgotten the bloody amount of bricks that I just put down. Thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty. Okay, we'll go and count forty out down here. Where's the property line? Three, third, third. Dirt, dirt. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. 40 and then mm. huh it's almost like I planned that
see the grid system that I developed is some way mathematically perfect like I didn't even plan that building but it just kind of I, I kind of built that but somehow there is an even amount of blocks on each side it's funny those two gaps there is exactly the same width as a wall so that could be an outer wall and that could also be an outer wall see if I was to have a building here I could demolish that wall and it wouldn't interfere with that wall I could keep that building that's why I have the two layers so let's get that other wall alright so that settles it Two down, did I? Oh, hang on, I can fix that. Uh, sixty nine, dude. was correct I think yeah. oh yeah it's two from the main two down from the ground level back okay there's our foundation so that go too far. See how we go. Whoops. Look how quick that went green. Oh, you would, wouldn't you? Ruin my ribbon. to establish what kind of a business this will be and how wide it will be because we've got to take into account that it does take up two wall spaces so if we make it too wide then we might have this tiny little bit left at the end so what I'll do is I'll divide this again Okay, 
Okay, so how are we going to do that? Need to find the middle. Hopefully we get two again. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Ha! Genius. Okay, and of course, separate buildings. So s they each get their own double wall. So, we'll actually build it as a separate building, so even though they're connected, they will still have the same old brick wall, the same patterns in there, because, you know, at one stage, this building was probably standing here by itself, and then later on, someone else put another business here, and so on and so forth. And when people demolish buildings, sometimes you find these str ghost signs, that are either still attached to the building that it was demolished or maybe the acrylic paint will transfer onto the building next to it the building with the sign is demolished and you'll get this reverse image and when the big Coles Fosse building was demolished in Brisbane City you could actually see the word pennies written on the side i got a photo of it somewhere okay so these are our two businesses. They're pretty big. So, I think the post office should go here. Right on the corner. Right in the center street. Because this here is considered the center of town. It's pretty close to position zero not exactly but it's pretty close city hall's there so you got your city hall, you got your GPO which is general post office, so this is the centre of town so this will face the centre of town so what colour bricks I'd like to avoid having too much red. Problem is, I don't know what an old post office looks like. Now let's clear the palette. Let's see what we get to play with here. Right, we definitely want some stone and some brick. We may get some stone brick. Let's have a look at this one here. I'd like to use some of that somewhere. Definitely steer clear from these. These look too modern. Sandstone was often used, but I might save that for the bakery or something because it's too close to the school. You don't want you don't want your colours too close together. We got some of this. I have it at ground level, so let's put our cornerstone in. Let's find the other cornerstone here, which is here. And 
Let's go across. Like this. Just do the, f the front part for now. Alright, and we need some brick. Where's the traditional bricks? Also, we need to establish the middle for the doors. Now, let's just do that now. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So these are the two middle bricks. Let's get rid of these. Let's put a placeholder here somewhere. Just use some cobblestone. This won't be the f formal footpath. Door. Go across. Put something nice in here. Need to establish roof height, so... Build the basin. some old school wood. Let's go with the spruce. There'll be some nice carpet here in the future. I'll even ha be able to have the words post above this door because it's four blocks. So let's do that now. Let's set blocks. give it a nice corner. Something smells nice. And we'll go one more. Oakley Doakley. do the interior for walls. Um, you won't see these, these will be hidden away. Uh, 
Okay. Actually, let's have a look at our old concrete here. We want something that says post-war surplus paint is cheap. So we'll just paint it with that. There was greens because of camouflage. A lot of you, uh, the boats were painted. So a lot of greys were used. Um... We'll try out the try out the terracotta. Actually, didn't I have that in the school? No, I used that. I think I used that for the bottom originally. That's okay. It looks dull and boring, which is what we want. Fancy stuff. Was stripped out of buildings for the war because they could be recycled. So, a lot of wrought iron scrolling was salvaged. You know, a lot of fences with the spikes on them. They cut them off. Make ammunition. Make airplanes. Might have a countertop here. We could go there. On second thought, like I said, face the street. Let's have it on this side. How did I have that? And then we might come down and... for now. Might even change the colour. We might put some some of that trimming on the, the bottom and then the top. So as long as we get the walls right first, I say as I'm stuffing it up. Where's that? <laughs> okay. Perfect. We'll soon know when we go inside. Nope, it's not perfect. Okay.
too. We can mirror that. Now, I do love my symmetrical. Ah. Not good. It's okay, there are ways around this. Hello, friend who's just logged on black blurry thing on the screen we don't want to stand too close to the door nice big area here let's just put these here for now We want that trim. Might have that hang down a bit. What's going on here? Why can't I get inside? There's no reason why I can't just do that. One, two, three, four, five. Three, four, five. meticulous where's that oh, I had it the whole time trial and error Okay, this wall just has to go then. You can't win them all. Stone. Stone, where are you?
That looks like it could be old. And look at that. That just happens to be exactly two. Which means we can have high ceilings. Alright, let's clear the palette for a sec. Go over here the old box. P oh, P O S T <coughs> Oops, that's it. S T O P Wait a minute. I got my letters mixed up. Would you look at that? See if we can get fancy. Let's get rid of this. Let's do some... I don't get too fancy. Now we're going to do this. Let's get some placeholder. Try and repeat that on the other side. Or was it? Yeah. Are oh, you, you seriously? Just once, do what I want. Let's get rid of that. I <laughs> should have titled this post office. Instead of just... <laughs> title for a episode all right where's that stone that looks way better than what it looked before it looks very it looks old but it looks fresh have some light grey oh look at that terracotta where are you? Is that what I used? Yeah. That l looks like a brown. But when you look at this, it looks more like a musky pink.
Where's the stone steps? Stone step. Let's have a look at these brick steps. Again, that looks too modern. Post office is supposed to be a safe place for information and valuables to be sent. So we want this to Play, we want it to look like a fortress. Don't want them commies looking at our stuff now. Look at that very m minimal brick there. I was a bit worried about all that brick, the red one. It's very minimal. fact Where's the Where are you? Oops. bit better
think. Whoops. I thought too much. I think I'll leave it like that. <coughs> Amazing what you can do with a few bricks. Okay. Well, it looks like our line's already drawn for us here. the wall here that'll give me a gap of two but if I have it here it'll give me one and it'll be very minimal red brick just like this Depends on how much room's here. Got to think about this. It's not easy to change once you get too detailed. So let's have a look. Why is this here? Alright, cross again. Let's give it some of that brown. Let's go across the way. large area I think I might have a hallway go across I think perhaps the post office should go around like this and we have something small here like a small boutique little jewelry shop flower shop yeah, florist. I mean, keep that driveway there. Post comes in, delivers at the back door. There's our first problem right there. What have we got here? The wall's there, but then there's another wall. Ah, get the brick. Brick, where are you?
wanted to have another window there. But if we put the wall here, then... It can be fixed with a line. A simple line. Alright, watch. Watch this. this wall up. Then we just mirror it. Watch this. Um, bricks. Well, that's not brick. How is that brick? No, stop doing things. I am the master here. How many did we have? One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Get it nice and symmetrical. Huh, magic. I reckon I could do that twice. One, two, one, two. Yeah, that's gonna work. I have the sorting office out here. Of all the post office box. I don't know whether they had personal post boxes back then. Okay, so... We'll do... We'll do that, but we won't put the line. And... And, and, let's do it again, go, okay. one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, do the glass, And then just repeat that in in reverse. And then forget that building. Um, a back hallway. Yeah, hallway this way, long hallway that way. All right, that's it. That's what we're doing. So keep going with the brick. Just um, one, two, 
three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then of course do the other window. One, two, three, four, five. You know what? I think I may have won. I think I did it. I, I That was where the milk bar was. So we're not in the footprint of the bakery. Let's have a look at that. Brick. Bricks. They're all bricks. Brick. With bricks on top. And then we got those weird bricks. it until it's finished. Get this side done. Really? Really? Seriously? Oh, come on. Don't mess around. When I've done this, I will stand back and I will have a look at it. when a, if a building gets put here there'll be this blue, beautiful flashing here but they'll be chipped away or we could just have it in there but you know, when these buildings are standing by themselves they, they look magnificent and then, then they're going to go and destroy part of them so they can build something against it you know I always like that movie Up where the guy refused to sell his home to the developers so they built around him. That was actually based on a real house. And the, I think the construction manager actually made friends of him and when he died he left the house to him in his will. So. Come on. Serious? Now that went around. Look at that. Oh, come on. Oh, it took me a little few seconds to notice that. Right now, let's take a look. It's symmetrical. Still haven't built the second story yet. There'll be a second story, so um, maybe the way to get to it will be through a back alley at the for uh, florist here, a little cutaway. Maybe there's someone living up again, up above it. Maybe this will become a Chinese restaurant in the future. Someone pays rent to live up there, the Chinese restaurant. You got your rent? You pay rent now. See, 
can't believe that fit. The grid system is perfect. The hillside code works. What we'll do is we'll make the top make the bricks stand out more. The, the red brick. Oh, I could make it out of sandstone, that would look cool. have to do is pretend that we actually built this over here as well exactly the same um, so that we get an idea of where to put the windows on the back Actually, we don't have to pretend. We don't have to pretend at all. Nah, we're gonna pretend. It's too much work. Okay, where's the... So that's the outside. That's the outside wall. So that is where the actual building supposedly ends. But it will keep going down this way. slipping running out of ideas I think. I think the Fallout seventy six updates distracting me. And women. All right. Have to go over a bit more. All right. That. Look on the front. Yeah, it's the same. So, bricks. We'll just go dirt over there, do the same thing, and we'll just keep going until we meet up in the middle. Hopefully, the math is correct. The thing is that 
there'll have to be a hallway that goes through two walls there. Okay. Five. Let's go down the other side, do the same thing. Three, four, five. If this meets up perfectly, then that proves that it is perfect. If it doesn't, then you can laugh at me. Alright. Let's get some inspiration. Yep, awesome. Okay, and we can save it with the middle bit there. Alright. Let's go with the brick again. Like this. No, like, not like that. And then go one, two, three, four, five. Step, 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 step. On my foot. I'll slap you again. Okay. Let's go down the other side. One, two, three, four, five. Once I caught a fish alive. The middle's a bit of a stretch, but that's okay because. Hang on a second. What's going on here? Ah! Always check your work. I wasn't concentrating. See? You know what caught that? You know what caught uh, got my attention was this thing here. I was looking at that, and it doesn't see. Look short. Well, you should look here. Short, long. Two, three, or five. Brick. Brick. That's looking good. Alright. Brick. No, that's not a brick. Brick, brick, brick. Brick, brick, brick. Nah, nah. Nah, nah, nah. Did it, did it, did it, look at that. Well, I didn't know what the back was going to look like because it looks nothing like the front, but you know, I'm satisfied with that. It's a good even number. I could put a door there if I wanted to. But I think for now we'll just. You know, put a wall. We, we could even just go like this. Man, that looks good enough.
four, five. Once I caught a fish alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I let him go again. Why did you let him go? Cause he bit my finger so. Which finger did he bite? This little finger on my right. that there let's give these windows a good flat look at that that's even the same on the corner there see if you look at it in 2d it's still one brick one brick they're all bricks Red, grey, red. Is it two? It's up top. Okay, so. I'm going to retitle this YouTube video The Post Office Because it looks like I found something to do tonight have to uh have to imagine a line here. That's pretty decent for a shop size. What I'll do had to be an odd number, didn't it? to decide whether to put it here or on this side okay I think we gotta look at the room sizes so if I put it on this side that's pretty narrow. There'll be enough room coming down here for you know shelves and stuff against the wall. Looks pretty from the front. And then if we go here, it's pretty much the same thing. Except another hallway let's get the basin down I usually just mumble talk nonsense but it's all working up there Art is never correct, but the imagination always is. I've always stuck by that. Okay. Looks so much cleaner when you do it like this. Whoops. I'm gonna say something good, something the tiny little thing just annoys me.
God, it's been an hour and a half already. Is anybody even watching? What's going on? I've lost my rhythm. That's a pretty good footprint there. Okay, I think what I'll do is I'll draw this line across anyway. sorting office. Got to think. Never actually been into a post office. Okay. Stuff comes in, it's sorted. Why would this area exist? What goes on in a post office? Quick, easy access to parcels because you don't want to go all the way out back here because Mrs whatever her face is, wants her cookies and insulin and whatever she doesn't want to wait, she wants to get the stuff and get the hell out of here so these are the access stuff short term outgoing outgoing and sorting alright so we're just going to get an idea how big? Okay, that's it. Yeah. Get rid of this. Get rid of that. And we put the wall there. It's symmetrical. Wall meets up with the window edge. Same with there. We're in the hallway. It's exactly the same. Although, I still got the entire wall to do. <sighs> Didn't think of that. Alright, we need some placeholders. Alright, we just gotta assume that Okay, that will be greened up. Oops.
am I gonna fix this little conundrum? It's a double wall, so that is the wall. So I want a mini hallway coming down here which meets up with this hallway. Or maybe it just opens up into one big area. Maybe there's a half wall here. A lot of things to think about. See, I've never been in one of these places. <laughs> Alright, I think we'll clear the pallet. Let's go with the same spruce floor, and we'll do the floor. Lay the floor down. Um, post office, post office. I don't want to look at Google and cheat. I want to do this like my own way. But let's have a look at the terracotta. Have a look at these ugly greens, greens, these browns, maybe brown terracotta. Look at the orange. Look at the wooden trims, maybe go with dark, pine. Let's have a look at the patterns. These things, jungle. Spruce. I've right, got, got our test pot here. Now, I said that this was conveniently at two, so this would be the ceiling. So, this is the top uh, wall line, so let's get rid of that without taking that out. that that and surplus green Doesn't have to look pretty, I mean, post-war. This is the same green that I have as the school floor.
Oi. So I didn't want to have two woods right next to each other like that. I like that. Might go with that. We'll go right along. We'll make this all the same colour. Get this room coloured up. What's a hablet? Habit. That looks good. If I was working here and I was a postman, I'd definitely want to go postal. From all the stress of the customers and this boring as hell wallpaper. That's pretty good. It actually looks like a like the top of a desk. One of those really what is it, art deco desks? You got the leather and you got the the wood edges. Now it's got a real good art deco colour to it. That's what I was going with the city hall. Was it this floor? Was it this floor? That's kind of art deco. To the floor, that's art deco. Terrazzo floor. Actually. Get away with that being terrazzo. It's what I usually use for it as asbestos. Let's uh, let's apply it for our. this in the inventory but I gotta go into the menu and then find it is that interior wall or is that exterior? It's interior. Oh, 
you do test my patience. Wait, is that... Ah, come on! Ugly as hell. Ugly like me. How dare you? I don't want to get too close if I rapid fire accidentally hit that. Alright, um. That's gonna bug me if I don't do that now. Get rid of that. Alright. The bottom is this. Just go around like that. No, that's wrong. Okay, that's the trim. Go across. Ding. Ding. Like a typewriter. Ding. Take care here. See, every time I say take care, all this is awesome, or blah blah blah, I do something that just irritates me just slightly. Watch, I'm doing awesome. No. Yeah, good. Yeah, I stop, see? Alright, now let's get that terrazzo floor down. Hopefully it looks good. this make sure I didn't do that anywhere else all right did I delete you We're gonna have to put a pad. See, you really gotta use your imagination. I use this as a as a roof. And I call it asbestos because it is fireproof and it just looks ugly. Yeah, it needs a pattern. Um, it uses a pattern. Maybe this oak. Aha! Very art deco. Oh. That's gonna irritate me. That noise. It doesn't sound like a terrazzo floor. And 
that just looks stupid. Consistent noise. Let's have a look at it from above. Let's have a look at it through the window. You know what? That looks old. familiar too. I, don't, I can't picture where I've been that I've seen a floor like this and a wall. Might have been the Arcade Brisbane. Maybe I can repeat that in here. Anyway, let's get this. Ah, uh, cobblestone, cobblestone, where are you? Uh huh. Oh, we can't have that. Gotta have that there. Gotta have that there. We'll just go across. Too much. Just go about there. That is the wall. Cobblestone. Second story will definitely be made out of wood. Like the floor. Just do this. Okay, I th think. Yeah. Okay, so the wall will come here. Of course, we'll have to put that there. Leave that. There. There. Bit of fireproofing. Okay, and we go across. Forgot about the toilets. <laughs> How wide's this hallway? I like this. One, two, dirt, dirt, dirt. No, we want double. We want. Uh, don't always have to have double doors. 
only go through one door. Unless it's a saloon, you just swing both arms out and take a look, see what breeze through the door. I didn't know the circus was in town. Must have got that shirt up from a dead Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the future reference. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I like that. See, when you got that cobblestone foundation, it just looks neat. It's something that you know, never see, but... I mean, look at that. That is a good size for a room. I'll still probably keep that wall there. I would have just had it go around the corner. Maybe I'll... Uh, Let me think about this. Right, let's get this let's get this wall done. Green is really growing on me, man. Coming up on the second hour here. Okay, and of course, the trim. I might make that an extension there. Yeah. Ah, you'll see what I mean. <laughs> okay, so... Just trying to find myself here. If I went like that and then came a corner, so therefore it has to be on this side. Dirt, dirt. So uh, just mumbling, don't worry about that. Come around down here. That is the corner right there. Take that. Uh, 
and there you have your second shop and hang on hang on hang on hang on having another idea here no I'm not what am I thinking I'm crazy I'm crazy don't know what I'm talking about just do it don't think just do just go like this I'm just I'm just drawing. I'm not even thinking now, just doing it. Okay, that looks good. Mathematically perfect. See, I say perfect. Any words like perfect, excellent, awesome, doing well, it jinxes me. Is it three? Is there one above it? Now, yes, it does. It goes up to the window. And of course, it goes over it like that, except for there. Alright. Give me that. Where is it? It's here. windows here in spirit
these will be bricked over. But they'll still have a thing, so yeah, in the future it'll be oops. So it'll be like this. That's what they usually do. Just brick over it. Usually the bricks are odd colour too. So they might not use those, they might What would they use? Well, usually it's very poorly done. They haven't even scraped the excess concrete out of these grooves. Here's our first problem. No, there's no problem. Because there's a pattern, that's right. Alright, we're going to have to work out a pattern here. That, not to the matter, it will never be seen, but still. Okay, and then, of course that that across uh, well would have there been a window here there might have been one two three four five no no I don't think there would have been Could have been. I don't know. Let's figure something out. Um, Much room we got in there. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Let's get rid of this for a sec. Let's put these here anyway. And we'll just brick it up. Grey brick, brick. One, two, three, four, five. Hey! Two, three, four, five. And another lifetime. That wall might not have been there. Wait a minute, hang on. No, the wall was there. I said so. One, two, three, four, five. Bricked up. Brick this up. I wish there were different variations. Maybe they can be, hang on. Let's try 
why they say it for sake. Such detail. Yeah, we'll go with that. One here, one here, one there. There we go. It looks like someone made a good effort to brick it from the other side, but well, there was another building there, so they couldn't really make it neat on the other. Awesome. Look at the little details, man. Okay. Of course, because there's a building here, there won't be this flashing. But there will be this. Actually, there won't. There'll be... to be cracked brick like brick blocks
Yeah, I was going to do this, but... You know, have you got that little cavity in there? That's where the rats come through. Did I just... I did. Alright. Need random here. That, that there looks like if someone was to demolish the building here in the future that they did a lot of damage to the other building while doing so. But usually when concrete's poured it sticks anyway to rough surfaces. It's okay, usually another building goes right up in its place so it doesn't remain this ugly for long. back area is going to have to be concrete because it is uh, well some of it will be the hallways are going to be terrazzo now because this here is actually a wall for the other building, we'll use that. So in doing so, instead of having blocks here, we'll, we'll, we'll have this hallway extended by two blocks. We can do that because there's a wall here. Let's do that. Clear the pallet. Uh, what do we use? We used jungle, didn't we? No, that's wrong. Uh, was it this one? Dark. And that. And... Lime. First things first. that <coughs> cobblestone because it is a corner that's still not right dark Spruce. Oh, because it's... Yeah, I get ya. It's the bark. That means we'll have to get rid of that too. Maybe the upstairs apartment will be up 
just on this bit here the roof will be uh, I did say I would do that that's where I start to slack off here Board very easily. Alright, continue that around. Let's just do this and fill that in. Let's put that floor in just. This looks way better than that other crappy building I had. Okay. I think... Toilets here. Ooh, ah, ah, damn, I'm tired. What time is it? Nine forty one, nowhere near. Okay, um. We're getting too fancy here. Let's... Oh, no, can't have that. We'll just do this here anyway, even though this room's not going to be... Probably not going to be coloured by this. These windows probably won't even be here. They'll probably be a double doors. One, two, one, two. Can't have roller doors because they don't exist in the game, so. Okay, is that. Yeah, that's the out inside wall, so... That's... That's a wall! That's a wall! So we got f three bonus two bonus bricks here that we can use for the toilet but this corner here what about it what about that corner that's your wall right there double Double. Let's, even though we're not colouring the walls, this we'll just do them up anyway. Every wall will be the same. They're just placeholders. So across. Fill that in. just want the basic shape, the floor plan first. <laughs> one male, one female, no big epic bathroom.
Uh, come on. Okay, that's a wall, so... That also has to go. No, wrong one. Why is that even still in my inventory? This wall will come across. So therefore... That has to be filled up. That's a really complicated... God. Gotta establish this, hang on. Open this, open that. That's the inside wall, we can't use that bit, so we just got this and that. Um <laughs> One toilet for all these people? Ah. Look at that mini hallway. It's double wall. One, two, double wall. We're eating into our bloody workspace here. Okay, so why is this here? Do we need a hallway? Why can't this be the toilet? Can't there be staircase in there to go upstairs? Maybe they're upstairs. Maybe they are. There, that's it. That's what I'm going to do. Let's not worry about the bottom floor. This will be a staircase. Get rid of this wall, but have a sort of little half wall. Make this an open area. Staircase goes up top. Door here. Alright, settled. That's it. That's what we're doing. God, you're a genius. And then under the stairs, we can do the 
the factory workers, and since most of them are just men anyway, because that's how they were, very sexist in the workplace. Women were secretarial jobs, and men were working in the thing, but that'll change in the future. So, their toilets will be rough. So we need to start a staircase. Let's clear this pallet. Go for some really dark Why did I clear the pallet? Go with this. Go with the lime. Spruce. Two, one, two, stairs. Wall, wall, uh, bloody wide stairs. Can't have them that wide, that's just stupid. Three at the most. Whoops. No block there. Come on, play fair. forget the floor goes up too so placeholder placeholder oops and then of course I said Get rid of this. Is that the double wall right here? And look at that right there. That makes the trim. The only problem is, is that. don't even use toilets. There's no way to poop in this game and I'm going to all the trouble. So pedantic. Just... Uh, the things I have to do. Let's establish that wall. That's the actual. 
actual line right there. Genius, you are a genius. Stairs don't have to just go straight up. I am a genius. Start them here. Put that there. Da da. Da da. Da da. Na na na. The thing where the roof is. Put placeholder in. Red concrete, yellow concrete. So red is. We'll go yellow. And of course. Red is the floor above the roof. So therefore we have to... when you go up you need your little box and that becomes the floor again. And spruce. No, 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 no. No, yes, yes. These are just placeholder pieces. Of course that'll be like that. along till just there yep like that and then so that is the floor That is the floor. So therefore we have to copy this roof height on the next floor. Which is one, two, three, four, five. So if that is the floor, one two, three, four, five. 
we'll just put that there because well because uh, zone now what's that doing there So we'll do the test. I don't feel like I'm gonna bang my head on that. And even so I can just do something like that. Okay, piss these stairs off. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five ground level. Is that right? Ground level. That is the ground, so that is the trim. We'll just put that there so that we know that that's the trim. That's where we're aiming to get the stair up. So, what? Mm, to a it and of course landing complicated
ugly. Space to work under there. It's a bloody mess, that's for sure. But you know what? It will work itself out. Alright, so let's do the roof then. Usually I would have done that red material. Why aren't I using that red material? Oh, we've got to be careful. If I come the wrong way, I could demolish that lettering and then I'll have to go all the way over the sunny side to get the lettering. Ah. <laughs> what kind of a floor am I going to use now? Just white, I think. We'll go with block of quartz, maybe. I love that uh, because it's really high we can use lanterns It just looks like you could jump up slightly and smack it, like kids do at the train station, they jump up and smack the signs above. do that. See, if I had the full three layers I could have put some redstone torch and had the redstone lamps. Oh! I didn't know you could hang them without that. Yeah. Oh, 
here. Very dim. What'd you expect? The paint scheme is really dim. Some sun comes up, it plays the the bell. What do you call it? The Westminster tune. So I might as well continue that. Get rid of that. See that through, did I? Whoops. Always oh, gotta be there, bang. Reminds me of those flammable bloody styrofoam tiles. want it's gotta be clever
second of green though. Yes, yes it is. <laughs> Correct out. Got all that space under those stairs. I can put a wall here. I got two toilets there. Look at it. <coughs> Got something. Squeeze anything. Now I could even have a little staircase going down and just have dedicated toilets down the stairs. You know, just a room and it won't have to obey any rules because it's it's down there, it's out of sight. You get more room. Okay, the desk. Uh, how may I help you? Um, yeah, I sent a letter and it didn't get to my girlfriend. Did you put a stamp on it? Uh, what's a stamp? open hmm. this will definitely have to to go. Put that. Mm. Not too. Probably make it wider. Like that, and then. Uh, go down here. Some of that die, right? Do we want the desk flush or do we want to be in? So we'll approach the privacy, the desk. What color is a desk? Nice dark brown. Orange. Orange pretty ugly. That's pretty ugly. I hate it. Like genuinely hate it. Let's go with some concrete or terracotta. What is that brown? That 
looks too artificial. Looks like plasticine. We need something with texture. Maybe a log upside upright. Oh, I am tired. Why is that wall so dark? Oh, because that's not the outside wall. <laughs> um, middle? That's not the middle. Would be pretty art deco. Those um tile bricks that you see in the office buildings. And to start. Be nice. Ah, where's the doors? Always losing the doors. so we can see what we're doing. Let's 
get some light in here. One, two, three, on four, and one out. One, two, three, on four, and one out. Is there a middle? There is no middle. I'd like there to be a middle. Problem is now I've just stuffed myself, haven't I? Because now it's not symmetrical. No, it doesn't matter here. One, two. One, two, hey, we can fix it. There's always a way. I get too detailed.
Can't win. One, two, three, one, two, three. Only lights give me the problems now. Jeez, we're going three hours. I hate that. The rules keep changing on block placement. I mean, what's happened here? How did I get that hole there? Apparently I got the hole there. Okay, it doesn't matter. matters that I did that. you just gonna have to be straight. Why is that up there? Why is that there? Right, let's not worry about another bloody thing. Clear the pallet.
We're going to finish this bloody ground floor once and for all. Okay, we need... We need that spruce. Because we have to do some trickery with the floor. Need... And what do we need? Why do I use that dark? Well, we're not keeping this floor. So get the spruce out. Get the cobblestone. Let's fluke it. I can't fluke it. have a nice colour slab. Very art deco. Let's forget about that, that floor for a moment. I'm not gonna put a doorway up. Go rose. Let's go with brown. like this pattern already. Just rose it. Lo it looks like that thing at the start of the menial life where they're all lined up in rows and they're just being tortured at work. The crimson pirates of something, I don't know.
that there for now. Flip these around. Oh, that's way better. Then they can all look this way while some customer's getting angry at the, the teller guy. Still looks boring. Clear the palette. What kind of boring floor can I use? Not much to choose from. Come on, Notch. Surprises. Wrong with one direction. Is that the same? should have done this first. Exhausted, man.
<sighs> Didn't watch it, did ya? You said you were. in this very dull um, why didn't I use that I mean it means I don't have to put anything on top there Why would there be a ma an office inside a post office? And what do post people do? I just think it's 50s, so there's still Western Union, so there's still some sort of telegraph system. They'd have customers, but I doubt a customer would come back here. Uh, we have a hallway, don't we? We had a hallway. We did have a hallway. There was going to be a hallway here. So, there's going to have to be a door there now. Could be a desk here too, yeah. One, two. Fishing licenses and stuff. Or post boxes. Dead letter office, people try and decipher the addresses that are crappily drawn. Wrong postcodes. It's clutter. Needs that. Painting item frame. So if we're using a painting, we'll need some blocks. Just use that one. Got a trick. Trick it into working. Some shelving. I need a clock. Maybe some bookshelves. Ah, oh, damn it. Ah, oh, some filing cabinets. Alright, let's see what we've got here. We need a clock here. We're waiting for the clock to strike on three. Well, that's not a picture. That hardly seems encouraging. 
picture of that. We can't have that. Or can we? Considering its connection to this story. Spoiler alert. Uh, some of these pictures make oh dear, some of these are depressing and they'll go postal. That's why we need this and this. Nah, it looks out of place. Take that away. Put that Ah, that's an uneven wall. right above this after all they're all facing this way yeah man you got the time I can barely see that yeah it's almost beer o'clock <laughs> get back to work That guy is a flower. And that one. Wait. This is an office, they're probably women. Ooh, that's sexist. Well, that's the way it was. Two clocks, you mad? That's a trick it. Can't have that. All that. What's that? All right. Might need a little fern. Yeah, that looks all right. Although, get rid of that. Might put that up higher. So, what looks like a table? Put something on top of that. What? Uh, that's an object that opens. I did not know that. Never used it before. Need something that doesn't open. We can't have the beehive in there. That's very dangerous and funny. People aren't paid to be funny in the post office, they're paid to work. We need something. Maybe this. Yeah, that's alright. I can't have that there.
does he get books? No, he doesn't get books. I mean, she. I mean, that looks like a shelf where you have, you know, all your parcels in. office back here doesn't mean you can see it. How are we going to do this? One, two, three. Two, three. Delete, delete, delete. Uh, puzzle for Coleman. Gavin Coleman, let me see. Oh, here you are. It's a big parcel. That's what she said. <laughs> okay. See, if I wanted to get one up there, I'd have to stack it here and then push it with a piston. That looks like a post office. Look at that. It's very Art Deco. Nice big picture of... censored on the wall. Come, you'll find out who that is. I mean, if you're really clever, maybe you can figure out why. Well, that was a bee. Maybe you can figure out why it's in the basement of this, of the Coleman house. Maybe even... In the Beacon Brothers Bacon Factory. Maybe all three are connected. Maybe one has nothing to do with the other two. You'll never know. Here's a clue. We ain't gonna look at it though. Look at that, I did all of that. Nearly four hours. That's disgraceful. Considering how it looked before. Yeah, 
there's gonna have to be something put here. But it's not gonna have a door there, it's gonna have to have um what do you call it? Maybe a a desk that you know you flip the door right up that you can walk through. Yeah, you know, kinda like in Willy Wonka where he comes up singing his candy man's can song and you might not know this but if you look at that scene where he comes out from behind the counter he actually smacks one of the girls right in the head and it's not scripted or anything he full on smacks her in the head with the door and that's just as funny as when the stormtrooper smacked his head when they burst in on R2-D2 and C-3PO in episode 4 the, you know, the first movie of the original trilogy yeah some easter eggs there I'm giving you all the easter eggs just after easter and right at the end okay so rest in peace bakery that's gone there's the kitchen I mean this kitchen will be reused but it won't look as cheesy it's not gonna have this stupid colored glass it's not gonna have this wall and the kitchen was the reason why this was possible although ah come on there is not a single thing left in here well besides maybe a slightly edited stove and that thing up top but you know I just made something completely new using that old bakery kitchen as a, as a starting point damn I love this it really reminds me of the old club kitchen with this condemned wooden refrigerator. Meow. The coke machine's still empty. Mrs. Scott ain't even here. Librarian's never here. <gasps> She's down there. Maybe we can sneak out without her noticing. I see everything. Yeah, she does. The infirmary. We have a back entrance. And a medicine cabinet. And air conditioning. And a roof. With drainage. Perfect drainage here. Dean's office. Ah, oh, don't look in the placeholder room. The leading area. Junior kid's little secret hidey hole. Play matchbox cars in here and watch the bullies through that window there, run past, because they don't know where you are. Got your lumberjacks. With a working sawmill. It is a working sawmill. Yeah, the, the logs come in from wherever the plantation should be. 
Cut set up. Thank my brother for that. Look at that. It's even stripping the bark off. I didn't even notice that. Damn, he's a genius. What's he done here? Oh, that's the um, vacuums. They suck up the wood. Got it through. That's a bit modern. Down here. That one cuts it into planks. This one cuts it into further little planks and it doesn't work. Why does that not work? It never works. Stacked on the pallets. Now this guy here, he takes those out back here and customers come in and a little forklift here loads load some of these onto tines I don't know how look at this electric gate first of its kind in the area you've got the track going through mailbox men wanted apply within because we only hire men it's our 50s that's how we think Tim Bars Wood Emporium <laughs> whoops ah there we go yes um bye get the radio station to do see that one's already doubled up so I just gotta expand it a bit that's gonna look kick ass yeah there's gonna be a transit center here definitely get rid of this or repurpose it I don't know Maybe I can cut it up somehow. Well, there you go. Ah. All right, let's see what else we gotta do. Oh, I made more work for myself, man. All right, so where's that? Where's all our work gone? Alright, so finish this up. I won't worry about this bit for now. We'll concentrate on that church a notch. So we'll clear this out, make it all water. Make a channel, make it deep, make this go round, shear drop, yeah so it'll go round but it'll stop about, it'll stop somehow, um, break that, shear drop, little deck, what do you call it, a, uh, a jetty? It'll go. Oh, there'll be a concrete one that goes across. Maybe two jetties that come out. Because apparently priests take boats to work. Um, the fence comes down here. Comes down here, equal length, of course. So did it? I think it's twenty-three. 43, sheer drop as well, just brick wall, Ram uh, dirt ramp with trees on it, just like the hill, this will all be carved out, knives of a waterfall, lots and lots and lots of trees. 
I can't be bothered shaping this. It's just going to be trees as far as the eye can see. What is over here anyway? I haven't really looked. See, when I made this map, I intentionally made it only one block. And then I didn't merge it. I didn't merge the first 30 blocks. I so, when you look at it on the map, it's literally a square island. I did that so I had the intention of doing that with the next update and then doing the same thing so I'd, on the map it would have you know square and then another square so you wouldn't get lost if you found the square river you just knew where to find the corners and then just go diagonal and you'd find the center of hillside and then of course this version came along made it really big but you got coordinates so all you gotta go is um, zero is 71 zero and you're in the very center It's the center of the universe, right there. Sunny side. <clears throat> green whatever it's called I'll have to fix that up bring it up to code prison will be out there lumberjacks the school city hall church of notch the beacon the sign look okay, at it's wavy Oh, I can't be bothered waiting for the four hour mark. Goodbye.